The Changing Champs after party number one. Yay! Okay, there'll be a group discussion. Probably group discussion. Hi guys, what came up after Group Man Lord? Now, unfortunately, only two full albums. Back on the Clock and Fly Guys and Gals. And going into 2035, we can't, or you and April can't with the idea for the Mighty Morphing Pokemon Rangers. I don't remember who was being paired with what Pokemon or why, how. Anything like that, but I was trying to make the album based on that idea. But unfortunately, I only have four songs playing for it, which means it won't be digitated. Those four songs might be tacked on to Fly Guys and Gals, depending on how much space is on the disc. Um, other than that, the storyline was also moving in the direction for these Power Rangers to be paired up with Nate of various kinds. I'm not really sure where we were going with that. We were even pairing up the Tattoo Teens and BR Troopers. The goggles, I don't think we really care too much. I mean, yes, it is kind of important that there is a next generation of goggles, but <laughs> there's not really much there to go on. Um, I know Rebel and the Zoibots have a bunch of albums, so they'll get concert. Danger High Voltage, it's possible for me to do one for the first two, but they were also getting into a third album as the future cards ended. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, No Cross Wires only has four songs. Hmm. Now that has possibilities. I could. I'm getting a slight idea here. For maybe a three part album. Empire Change of Champs, Fly Morphing, Danger High Voltage, No Crossfires, and maybe Iron Goose's Last Hour, Last Hour, from this The Iron Made Up, and Here's a Panel. I don't know, that was. Uh, Silliest album name I ever created. But <clears throat> that might work. I'll just do it as a three part album. And we'll see how it turns out. So, until next time, you will look to the future. Who knows? These scripts might actually exist by 2030. Yes. Goodbye. Good night.